Welcome back, everybody. I am TJ Patterson. Welcome back to Detroit Become Human, and let's just jump into this. Last time we uh, left our characters, we Accessing were in a big-ass horror movie experience. Well, one of my knowledge. So, we've gone through, like, a good ripple of story, but now this uh, next part is actually going to be Connor. So, let's just hope we don't fuck this up. I'm hoping we don't fuck this up. Let's continue, guys. I hope we're going to have a great time with this. And, uh, again, it's only going to be one episode for tonight. Uh, I'll think about recording two episodes tomorrow. I, I know I, I would usually get the volume up very, very quickly. But, uh, usually do thanks to my busy schedule and all the other things that came after that, it's been hard to, you know, keep the uploads to a two to three video day. So, now we're trying to... <laughs> Uh, see what, see about, uh, other things, you know? Wait, oh wait, why am I back in the, uh, and why is it raining? What the hell? I'm back in this place again. <laughs> you know, it was to be expected, but I don't think I got Connor killed the last time. Alright, well, let's see what's going on here. Must find Amanda. What's this? Is this a grave? Oh my god, she actually... Really? She actually has the grave for the first Connor that got killed. Died at the DPD station in Detroit. November 6th, 2038. That's messed up. <laughs> she buried it. She freaking buried it. Alright, let's get back to business. Wow. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? No problem. Alright, now I gotta choose my words carefully because I don't want to piss Amanda off. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. That wasn't my fault. Pragmatic explain. Deviants are completely irrational, which makes it difficult to anticipate their behavior. But I should have been more effective. Did you manage to learn anything? Well, let's be... Uh, diary, signs on walls, birds... I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? Uh, there's signs on the walls. Walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. Let's just say it's Robo God or Robo Jesus. Close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? I'd say it's going well. Connor's death, saving Hank. He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. Amanda? We Hello? don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Uh-oh. -uh. Is she the the number one leader of all of Cyberlife? This is crazy. Like, again, see, he does that little fucking twitch right there. And I believe that, yeah, he's gonna become deviant. And all right, I, I, it's only a matter of time. Thank you for traveling with Detroit Town. We look forward to seeing you again It's still fucking raining. This is his, oh, I'm at his house. I don't know what the fuck was going on. There's his car. This dude's very old fashioned. All right, let's go in. Let's see what is what's uh going on. Lieutenant Anderson. 
Anybody home? Find a way inside. Please tell me that this man's not gonna try and kill himself. There seems to be his dog is on the couch. There's some takeout on the lawn, on the uh, dining room table. Uh, he said the only relationship he has is with this dog. Can I get into the window here? Oh shit! Oh god! What did he do? The fuck did he do? Yeah, his dog's not gonna like that. Ow! Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? <laughs> Damn. I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Really? Really? You hungry, fat ass dog. Wait, hold on. What the hell? Check on that. Got it. Jesus Christ, what happened to him? This man is very intoxicated. Alright, 357 Magnum, one bullet remaining. He was gonna he was playing on killing himself. Uh Scotch whiskey, 40% alcohol content. Damn! Dude. Traces of alcohol over his beard and his mouth. Uh, slight arrhythmia, no signs of trauma. Lieutenant. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. It was like, <laughs> it was like, oh, damn, no. <laughs> I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. <laughs> Thank you in advance for your cooperation. Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> uh, come on, Anderson. Hey, right, come on, Anderson. Shut up! Attack! Good job. <laughs> Attack! Oh, I, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. No shit, Sherlock. You're, you're you're wasted, man. Uh, Clancy Brown. I like. Uh, I really like. Alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> oh, why do I laugh so much? What I'm not grumpy. So. Oh shit. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. Oh. It's for your own good. <laughs> Really, Connor? Uh damn it, Connor. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world. Well, I am the only partner. Assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <laughs> Can't you just Jesus. leave me alone? Uh, dude, rational, aggressive solution. Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case, Lieutenant. I gotta stop saying yourself. the wrong shit. You should beat it. You hear me? Get the hell out of here, Lieutenant. The hell. Please leave. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. <laughs> Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. <laughs> There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. <laughs> oh my god, Hank is just fucking hilarious. Thank you, Clancy Brown, for taking the role. Oh man, thank you, Clancy Brown, for taking the role, man. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Uh, hippie, strippy, streaky. 
Uh, let's go with streaky. Uh, uh, I'm not really an old-fashioned streaky kind of guy, but... Hey, look, if streakies look good on the man, he looks good. Alright. I'm not a big fan of dressing people. Are you alright, Lieutenant? He's sick. He's drunk. What the hell yeah. is it? Yeah. <coughs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Oh, okay. Didn't need to see that. Learn more about that. Let's see. In her speech to Congress today, where she demanded that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic region immediately. Oh wait, hold on. I don't know what the fuck I was doing. Who the hell? Cole Anderson, born September twenty third, twenty twenty nine. Damn. The man lost his son. Oh, that ain't cool, man. I don't want to bring that up. That sounds like bullshit. I wonder why he's sad. Autumn Blues. Michigan Brothers. Detroit Soul Records. Hank loves jazz. Yep. That's B.B. King and, uh... Fuck, I forgot the other one. Hey, Sumo. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy, Sumo? You alright, buddy? Alright, hold on. I gotta Dark Knight this shit. Wait, something's over here? Talking about the bottle of whiskey? Ah, oh, Jesus. Questions say nothing. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Wanted to see how long I could last. Oh, Jesus. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. Jesus Christ, Hank. What the fuck, man? <laughs> you look good, bro. You're a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Sumo's a good dog. Damn. Oh, wait, I... Wait, I had... Oh, well. Left for the eating club. Alright, so we're not the... Take that be shirt, take the strippy shirt. I took streaky. <laughs> I don't know, man. Because, alright, so... Like I said, these, these little scenes right here... They don't really... They don't really, uh... Take that long to film... And that's why I always keep going for uh, two, t two chapters of story. So I think uh, the next one is Marcus. Yeah, the next one, the next one has to be Marcus, which means we gotta really be careful when it comes to Marcus at the docks. So we gotta steal without being seen. See, I'd like to. I would like to really get to the hang of it myself. So let's this hold this. Crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. All right, All right. Jericho is neutral. We gotta follow north. I'm just hoping we don't, you know, fuck up. And they said it's heavily guarded. So far, I don't see any humans, but. Don't let who see us. Oh. Wait. 
So, are we worried about the uh, the probe droids or the humans? Gotta move, gotta move, gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. Are we good? Watch out! Oh, that was supposed to happen. Okay, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Now what do we do? I'll find another way. All right, something's up here. I'm just hoping that I'm not trying to get any of these people killed. They look like nice people, and I don't want to fuck the mission up. By the way, this is all happening in uh, real time, I suppose, I think. Well, the setting is not in real time, but... Uh, graphics clipping. Why did it have to be graphics clipping? Oh, there it is. Follow north, let's see what the hell's going on. Oh, we got on a crane, okay. Marcus looks like Cole McGrath, I'm not gonna lie. Even though I know this is not the same actor who portrays Cole McGrath, but it's still pretty cool. See, there you go. Nice moves, man. Look, I understand that Marcus isn't Cole McGrath, but come on. You, you can't say that that doesn't look at least a, like a robotic version of him. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. All right, so how do we get rid of it? Leave it to me. Oh, boy. What are we going to do? Okay, so let's look at this. Alright, so do I take this way? I do it. Nah, nah. Nah, that'll get me killed, so... And then... Oh, okay. Alright, so we can execute then. And we gotta follow the CT. Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Alright, uh, we gotta hurry up. We gotta be careful. That's blue blood. Oh, we gotta be careful. Oh, damn it. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. Don't do it. God damn machine! Where is it this time? Alright. Kill guard. Grab and hide. I don't want to kill the guard just yet. Grab and hide. John! I need your help. John! Oh. Let's release him to there distract. You are. What the hell are you doing? I was inspecting the platform. Everything is in order. Good. Then I'm going back to the control station. I'm soaked. Take the drone to maintenance and make a report. Understood. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, sir. Thank you, man. 
I didn't think how well that would work. Let's finish up and get out of here. Yes, please. I find some blue blood. We still don't have enough. Yeah, we gotta be careful this time. Now, once we get the fuck out of here, we get the fuck out of here for good. Check the bigger crate. What? Ah, uh, you're really gonna try to put my life at risk, huh, game? Huh, game? I am not up for this, man. I'm, I'm trying to fucking do this the right way, and you guys, like, I, I want to make it easy, but you guys don't want me to. Ah, uh, Jesus Christ. What the hell? Oh, God. Why do they look like Marcus? Well, remember. Look, free them, close again. I guess free them? We gotta be careful, and I should have just probably been more careful to just close it. But the more the merrier, I suppose. Oh, so he can make them deviant. Wait. I, I don't get that. I, I really don't. Because that's very confusing. Marcus can make uh, them deviant? Or it wasn't because of uh, um, Alice or Amanda? Oh, I'm, I'm getting go. in the trust of everybody. Alright. We can't fuck up this time, Take guys. Me with you. Are you sure you want to do that? We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring him back with us. It's too dangerous. Accept, refuse. Uh, accept. They come with us. The only reason why I, I say that... You can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. Oh, yeah. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Yeah, where is the key? Dude, I'm putting my fucking life on my on, on the line for you. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. Uh, we gotta get the key. Wait here. If I'm not back in ten minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. I just don't want to lose respect for a lot of people. Find the key. It's found. Steel electronic key. Oh god. How do I shut these dogs up? Alright. It's right there. No, don't do that. This gotta be. Well, walking behind the f the back door. See now, this is where I gotta really be careful. Can I just knock the guards out? Goddamn dogs! What the fuck are they? Barking? How am I get past the weather? They don't like storms. Yeah, I was gonna take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Is Mike still in zone four? Looks, Looks like, like it. it. And he should be done already. Better off. Been here than up before. Well, can I threaten the guards? Well, I don't want to threaten the guards and then. God forbid I kill them. Don't do it. 
Uh, this is not gonna be good. I gotta be careful. We gotta be careful. We gotta be careful. Yeah, put your weapon down. Oh! Oh shit! No! 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 Oh, gotta save him! Gotta save him! Oh, Jesus! Uh, kick! No! Oh, no, no! I almost pressed the wrong fucking button! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Ah! Oh. Oh, no! Ah, oh, damn it! Ah, oh, I won't get a second chance! I won't get a fucking second chance! Oh, Jesus. I will not get a second chance from that. I don't, and, and I thought pressing the wrong button was gonna fuck me over. Alright, come on. We gotta go. We gotta fucking go. Alright, we gotta run. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We gotta go. We gotta go. Did you get it? Yes. We gotta get the hell out of here. Come on, we gotta go. Uh, come on. Hurry, get in. Yeah, I don't like this shit, man. Insert key. How the fuck do I do that? Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. So do I... I'm about to say, because I don't even... I don't think I have a... Uh... Yeah, there's no way. Damn it. Fuck. Well, at least they're not dead. I hope they're not dead. I hope they're not dead, at least. That's what I'm just begging on here. A truckload. We stole a whole truck. We got bio components for everybody. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. Yeah, Jericho level is up. North level is I up. Came to Jericho Josh is up. Here Andrew Simon's is free. up. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. Jesus. I am alive. Yes, you are. And they're not gonna take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they We're don't want to kill give, them, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. This is crazy. I think I just started something beautiful. And I'm just gonna shape it to be the best fucking thing I've ever fucking played. So there, there were a lot of fucking things that this could have literally have gone bad. See, but you gotta lose respect to some of the characters only to have a game back with more respect. Like, yeah, you can choose the free or leave the androids, but if you leave the androids, North disrespects you. Alright, John wants to join, accept, refuse, if you refuse again, it respects a lot of other people, but, yeah, see, when it comes to deviants, their trackers don't work. Now, I don't remember him, I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed making the video. If you haven't already, please like, comment, favorite, and subscribe to my video and all the other videos I have on this channel when they come. If 
Also, you haven't already, please like, comment, favorite, and subscribe to my brother, Jayonic Blaze. He is currently working on a few of those uh, RPG Maker video games again, like he used to when he first started out. And uh, he'll probably be back on the Stick of Truth at some point himself. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have been TJ Patterson. I love you guys very much. And I'll see you guys in the next video. This is TJ Patterson signing off. Have a good one, everybody.